library explorers. My name is Hillary, and this is Dewey. We're your local library explorers, discovering and exploring the world around us through books. If this is your first time exploring with us, welcome. We're so happy to have you. And if you're a returning library explorer, welcome back. Now, before we get started on today's adventure, I wanted to make sure that our new library explorers were ready. So without further ado, raise your right hand and repeat after me. I promise to keep an open mind, open ears, open eyes, and an open heart as I explore, discover, and learn about the world around me. There you go. You are officially a library explorer. Now, let's get going to today's adventure. See you soon. Hello, library explorers, and welcome to my kitchen. I just had Dewey over for a delicious vegetable pie and I've got some food scraps left over and I wanted to show you how you can turn your food scraps back into vegetables through propagation. I'll see you in just a sec. Oh, I almost forgot. What is propagation? Propagation is the process of taking a piece of a plant and turning it into a whole new plant. Are you ready to start propagating? Let's start exploring. So to get started, you will need some containers and some food scraps. I've got the bottoms of a piece of celery, carrot, and green onion. Once you have your materials, all you'll need to do is put them together. Add each of your food scraps bottom side down into your containers and fill with water so that the bottoms are covered. Finally, place your containers with your food scraps in a sunny window to help them grow. And voila! Food scraps ready to grow into new plants. And there we go, library explorers. Now you know another way of how to help the environment and to reuse your food scraps instead of just putting them in your compost, which is still important. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know down below in the comments what you enjoyed most or send me a picture of something you drew about what you learned today. I will see you next time, library explorers. Bye.